press B. Yeah, and he's playing a Belmont. You know, it's it's sound advice. Three, and two, this is um, one, Dome versus Yoshi. Right? Okay. I don't see Yoshi on the screen, unfortunately. Oh yeah, maybe. Or, yeah. or fortunately, depending on who you are. <laughs> A nice Nair string. Oh yeah, Game & Watch with Nair is, it's a scary tool. You can string into it. It's very good in this game. Much better than it was in 4. Oh yeah. And did that update just beat Cross? Or it's, oh, Wow, it did. Why? <laughs> that's actually... What a good move. Yeah, that's gotta be pretty useful in this that's matchup. very good for Game & Watch, actually. It might offset the fact that he's light and dies really early. Also, fucking reflects now in this game, so that's also very helpful in this matchup. Oh, yeah, you know, I didn't even think about that. It won't help against the whip, so. Yeah, but I think between that up and the reflecting bucket, honestly, it's gonna be hard for uh, Richter to get a solid edge guard in. Game watch has it. Ah, uh, no answer for that back here, though. Yeah, that that one was. There was like three minutes left on the clock for that test, and he was just staring at it. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, they. I, I always forget they changed game watch there to the bomb. Oh yeah. So I wonder how that will affect the matchup. I missed the credit card. Yeah, I think a lot of Game & Watch mains also did initially. I think in this matchup though, the Porter's gonna let him control a little bit more space. Oh, and we got the berry. Oh, down smash to F smash is so good. It it's really helps Very good in this game. Yeah, I mean, that'll close out stocks at around 80. 80, 90, maybe. I don't know how strong the berry is on that, actually, we could ask. Oh, yeah. Nearly avoiding the axe. Oh, that edge guard. Poor Richter. Yeah, Yoshi Freak did a really good job, like, keeping that momentum once he actually got in. Yeah, and didn't let him breathe. And then that happened. And we're, we're back to normal. And we're back to even. I feel like Dome has been having some trouble actually like really planting his feet somewhere and getting a good setup going this match. Like, Yoshi Freak's been doing that. He's been reflecting the projectiles. He's been like slipping on uh, like, slipping over the fire. Yeah. Doing a really good job of not letting Dome set up shop. Trying not to let him. That upbeat, beating out Axe is very, very good. And he's been abusing it. Well, oh, yeah, it's necessary. Necessary. Those of us who don't have the tools to deal with that uh, axe at the stage, oh, uh, we cry. <laughs> Every time. Alright, D3 Dome is in a good spot right now. Um, yeah, still in a good spot. Yeah, still holding, still holding that stage control. That'll be old. I was gonna say that B was a bit hasty, but then he landed with back. I said, "Does it really matter?" Yeah, it looked like Yoshi Freak wanted to move right, and then he got his wish. <laughs> uh, moved right into the blast zone. Exactly. So that, was, that was a pretty good first game. That was a solid first game. Both sides were pretty even. As that one decision that I always comes down to. It looks like Yoshi Freak's counter pick is Kalos, or Kalos, depending on who you ask. Ooh, I like that string. That was a very solid string. And it will get him a stop. I wow. was gonna say how Kalos is a big stage, and it, would, it benefits Richter a bit because he has more room to run around, but Yoshi Freak showing us that uh, that doesn't matter. Yeah, yeah, I think on the flip side, it gives Yoshi Freak a little bit more breathing room outside of that zone. Um, 
position, though. He didn't have much trouble with the zone in game one. Maybe he felt like having more space for both players to kind of move space like, out. Yeah. Would work to his advantage. It also might be the bigger blast zone to help him survive longer. Oh, yeah, maybe. Oh. oh, a little hasty on the ledge trap. Yeah, I think. Did that up tilt just flank with up B? Oh, I actually didn't catch that. I think it did. It saved him from eating the full up B, so. Man, I I don't know about you, but when I see Yoshi Freak go off stage with those back airs, I just get scared for Dome for exactly <laughs> that reason. <laughs> <laughs> he got he got caught, and then he ate a full-on back air. So, Game and Watch has an attack turtle ready as you go off stage. Here it is again, and I think that's gonna be the stock. That might be it. That that's it. Jump? Oh, no, he no, got it. He got, got it. it. Oh, but ooh, ooh, the SD from Yoshi Freak. Unfortunate. It's all right. Yoshi Freak's still in a really good spot. Still has that stock, whole stock to work with. Yeah, that was a nice up. Yeah, the field and dome. One of the strong, like, if you have it as a character, it's probably one of your best options that shield. Oh, yeah. See, that turtle, that turtle putting in the work is good. Yeah, really. Game & Watch went to the pet shop and he was like, I need, I, a, I need a snapping turtle. Stat. <laughs> <laughs> I've got a problem. Richter keeps beating me at Smash. <laughs> He's just pressing the B button. I His need to work, hit the. Not mine. I just need to hit the A button. Oh, oh that was that, an excellent setup. That was a solid conversion. And you know we've been focusing on the turtle, but now we have a pretty even game. Solid, solid, solid work. No. All right, Yoshi that time we did work. Yeah, I. I wonder what. I, I wonder what the limitation of that is now. It might have been too late in the animation. Maybe. Also, I noticing that Bucket is slightly filled. Oh, yeah. He must have caught some of the flames from uh, his holy fire. Yeah. I didn't know that counted. Interesting. Oh, that would make sense, actually, because holy, Richter's holy water is energy-based. It's aura. Oh. Ooh, that was a good that reflect. That was a good reflect, but he's... Ooh, oh, there are those bigger blast zones. Oh, and there's the... Crossed the up air. Ouch. <laughs> well played from both, um, both players. Hello, words. <laughs> Can't speak English today. It's all right, man. I've been there. 